Look, guys, this woman said that her DoorDash never arrived after I delivered it to the hospital. She works in front of cameras, so you know I had to go back. And oh my God, guys, look how this goes down. Excuse me, is Chris still on the clock? Who? Chris K. Uh, I don't know who that is. Okay. Do you know what office you're looking for? There she is. Hello. So you didn't get the DoorDash order? I'm sorry? You didn't get the DoorDash order from earlier? I'm at work currently, and I have no idea what you're talking about. I, well, we she, she even okay. saw you with the well, food. I mean, okay. you guys have cameras here. You said the order never arrived. I don't know. What do you mean? So, why does it say that the customer says the order never arrived? I don't know. And he wants to be. Okay. They couldn't make it for him. And were you just trying to get free food and put my job on the line? Did it do what he paid? Okay. Well, we're we got to figure something out because it says that the customer says the order never arrived, and I got a contract violation. Gotcha. I'm an independent contractor. Yeah, it's with. Okay. It's just crazy because when you look at her energy, bro, it's like look how fucking defensive it is. If this was really a mistake, her energy would have been like, oh, like, this happened to you? Oh, let me help you out. It would have been a helpful energy. That's not what we're seeing here. It's just completely defensive. She knows what type of time she's on, and this is going to be interesting. Gotcha. I'm an independent contractor? Yeah, it's with okay. Mary, the... So that puts my job at risk? The physician's so assistant. So we're going to have to call DoorDash support off your phone because I wasn't the one that said the order never arrived. It's on, it's an on your side of things. What? It doesn't just randomly happen yeah, magically. You have to get a hold of DoorDash support directly to say that the order never arrived. Okay. Um, it's a shared account, so it might be yeah, something I that somebody else did accidentally. I would have to talk okay. to them. Okay, well, but we're going to... currently gonna, at work. Yeah, I'm yeah. currently at work, too, and now my job's at risk because of... Right, I don't know. I, she said your boyfriend's name is Chris. She said she saw you with the food. So you, you got the food earlier, right? You down here, sir? Yeah. Okay. Like I said, yeah, first you, I didn't do anything. Okay. Okay, okay well... I could have used the wrong card, and he refunded it. It wasn't... It wasn't... You can't refund it. It's What's you... You reported the order as never arrived. There's no refund about that. Well, maybe, I mean, there is a refund if you don't get your order, I think, for your food. But that's the point of that is people don't get, like, my job's at risk. I can't just give you free food and sweep it under the rug. Like, it's not how it works. Like, I have a job, too. I have five kids. I got to feed. Like, it's not. I get that, but I didn't do it, so I mean... I well, I understand, so can we pull okay, the I phone out and figure them, out... I can't do yeah, it right now. let's... Okay. So, I but you got the food earlier? Yes. Okay. All right. I'm not... I'm not I didn't do it, so I'm not going to say... Okay. Here. Like, bro, the math on here is just not mathing. Earlier, she tries to make an excuse saying, well, maybe it was the wrong card. Let me get this straight. You had a card that had the right amount of money, but you're like, oh, no, it's the wrong card. So when I get my DoorDash order, I'm going to say that it was missing. Like, how the fuck does that make sense? Not only that, the constant, I didn't do it. I didn't do it. But it's like, bro, if it's either it's you, it's a shared account. Either you did it or your boyfriend did it. Which is like, okay, if your boyfriend did it, can we send him a text? Can we call him and say, hey, can you fix this? And she's going to say, I can't do it right now. I'm at work. It's like, bro, he's at work. You're both at work. And you work at a hospital. Look at you. Look what you're wearing. It ain't like you over here working with patients. You ain't a doctor in there. You're in the back doing paperwork, HR stuff. You have time to call your boyfriend. You have time to even have this conversation. You have time to call your boyfriend and tell him to fix the shit. But no, y'all finessing. Look at how when she first showed up, she was already choking up. And he, he barely got across what the problem was. You didn't put my job on the line? Didn't do what he Okay, well, we're good and put my job on the line? Didn't do what he Okay, well, we're like, bro, I'm not trained to read faces, but if I was going to judge her on this situation, guilty. <laughs> for real, her face immediately screamed she was guilty. For real, bro. Bro, 653,000 likes. Damn, we all, th <laughs> the fucking verdict is in. <laughs> we all think she's fucking guilty. Lamayo, like, why are you lying on people as if they didn't just come to where you are to bring you food, Lamayo? Glad you pulled back up on her. On dead, bro. <laughs> this is jolly. That's so funny. 
She's definitely a frequent flyer with DoorDash. Yeah, no cap. Normalize calling people out for real, bro. I wish that DoorDash people could rate the customer so they never get food again. Mm, right, but see, I can't see why. Why would why would DoorDash want to lose money? I just can't see it. Also, like you can only do that so many times. After a while, DoorDash won't like keep giving you like your food for free. You can only do it for if you only get a few freebies. So you didn't get your DoorDash order. Mm, right. <laughs> yeah. I'm currently at work. Like, bro, I'm currently at work too. No cab, bro. A hundred thousand likes. So guys, I kept tabs on a story because I know all of us on Facebook, just like me, want to know, did that violation get removed? What happened? What's the update? And guess what? He delivered. His name is Young Tusi, and he posted an update. So at this point, I got thousands of you guys uh, waiting to hear what happened to the DoorDash lady. What happened to me? I still get my job. I do. I still got my job, and um, I'm gonna just go ahead and get right into all of that. So yeah, long story short, um, that where that video ended, it it cut off like 30 seconds before I actually left the building. But you know, I just wanted to get her confessing on camera. You know, hey, I got the food, which she did. And after that, the video, so the video cut off, and I basically just told her, hey, look, um, I know, I guess we're not gonna get this solved right here, right this second. I said. But you got until the end of the day to get this contract violation figured out. I said, or if I wake up in the morning and it's still there, when I come back tomorrow, it's not going to be good. It's not going to be a fun time. And I said, I understand. And she said, I understand. And uh, that was it. So I walked out. Anyways, days go by, or not days, the day goes by. I wake up in the morning. That video is probably at 8 million. Um, I go to check my DoorDash app. Definitely don't have a contract violation on there anymore. So, she definitely took care of it, but, man, y'all was eating her up in that comment section, for real. It almost made me feel bad for her at some point, but I'm not. I just know that's going to be a, it's going to be an awkward, awkward uh, little work, work environment from here on out, because I know for a fact some of her coworkers was in them comment threads. I'm not even going to get into all that, but, God. So, moral of the story don't try to get free DoorDash food because your face might just be seen by tens of millions of people just for $20 worth of food. We got to be better than that, folks. Man, it is so crazy how you can get lots of views on TikTok and it can deal with like a corporate problem. Like corporate has to deal with this shit. Or either two, she went back and got that shit reversed because she, she didn't want him to pull back up the next day. Now, guys, I wish this was a happy story, but after making this video, he posted one more, bro, and this is just, oh my God. I ain't okay. got no motherfucker. Hi, Alexander. We regret to inform you that your Dasher account has been deactivated. We received a report that you had created an unsafe environment by using abusive language or verbally assaulting another person while engaging with the DoorDash platform. What? After completing our investigation, we determined that this co conduct to be in violation of your independent contractor agreement and the DoorDash deactivation policy. Oh my God, they still fi they fired him. They fired him for the situation. Please review the keeping the platform safe and secure section within the deactivation policy for further details. Bro, DoorDash. How could this happen? What did she say to them? What did she say to them? DoorDash, this is an L on you. This is an L. The only thing that I can think of that made this happen was when he said, hey, I need that violation dealt with by the end of the day. And if I wake up and it's not gone, I'm going to come back here tomorrow and it won't be good. Now, by definition... That's a threat. Anyone watching this? Is that a threat? I I think that's a threat. So like, uh, that's the only thing that makes sense. But then how do they know he did that? I, other than unless they watched his video up here, that would make, I don't know. I don't know. That's the only thing I can think of. Otherwise, DoorDash, this is a fucking L, bro. Oh my God. Anyone here that's a delivery driver? Is this how it works? Like you could just deliver the food and they can just say missing and you get a violation? Is there no way to avoid this? That's just fucked up. I wouldn't even want to work that job. Is that how it works, guys? Let me know in the comments. All right, y'all. What do you think about this? <laughs> You're not guilty. Guys. 
We just made it to 1 million followers! Everything that we've been posting, the TikTok story times, I never thought we would, would get this far! I'm really a music artist, but I make these videos because I know y'all like them. So can you please follow the page for me? And outside of all this dead gang, remember, it was just you. And you had a plan. You have come too far. Do not forget what you did all this work for. And I know you're discouraged, but you are close. We get one life and we not finna live it being no weak motherfucker. On dead and them, we got work to do. So pop your shit, star. If it was love, then why didn't you stay? I remember every time you told me that I was the one that couldn't be replaced. But it was so easy to throw us away. And the only way I keep my peace is thinking the universe wants it to be. I fucking love you, but not more than me. When I could die tomorrow, I cannot leave with no regrets. You acting different, I'm peeping on that. I really wanted to stay till the end. But I gotta take off these rose colored glasses. And know when it's time for me to walk away. So I can see we wanted different things. All of this effort, I'm tired of asking for it. Why did you ask me to commit? I see where this is going, it's into a ditch. 